So what is the matrix? How to break free from the matrix? Welcome to the real world. I've been expecting you deep divers at last. Now, a lot of people always say, Ralph, you're like Morpheus guiding us through Zion. And I'm like, oh, thanks. Take the red pill, take the blue pill. Deep divers, look, the 1999 film, The Matrix, was amazing with special effects, but also a great message that we're living in a kind of world which is controlled. It explored how there are agents around, there are systems of oppression, but it's a lot deeper than that film because it actually goes back thousands of years. Let's take a trip down the time portal. Let's go to the Indus Valley 5,000 years ago. Okay, you had great sages and masters. And in the Sanskrit, they talk about the matrix as being Maya. You see, the Sanskrit word Maya means illusion. This is when you have an absence of truth. It's the illusion world. And we are actually born into, all of us are born into the illusion, the Maya. Because these two eyes represent duality. But this first eye or the third eye represents the truth. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. So many great masters thousands of years ago, they worked tirelessly and they really worked on themselves to open this first eye to see the truth and not the illusion. And they became enlightened and enlightenment is actually the highest frequency. When we talk of the human emotional vibrational chart, enlightenment is at 700 hertz plus. And you become enlightened once your pineal gland is activated, once your third eye is open. A lot of us, we're born into a world where our third eye is closed, our pineal gland is calcified. So we can't see the truth. And going back to the Indus Valley, the matrix was the Maya, the illusion. So therefore, what is the matrix? It is the world around you, full of illusion. It is not the truth. It is the distraction, the mass media, the big corporations, BlackRock, Vanguard. But deeper than that, it's actually you. Oh my gosh, yeah, you are the matrix. I am the matrix. Society is the matrix. Society is you and I. You see, if you are living predominantly in your lower nature, you are in the matrix. As you rise to your higher nature and develop self-awareness, you now break free from the matrix. Welcome to the real world. So, this whole concept in the matrix is waking up, wake up Neo. And in life, we have to wake up to who we really are. This is how to break free from the matrix. You have to wake up out of the sunken place. The matrix is a lack of information, a lack of self-awareness, our ignorance collectively. That's what makes up the matrix. When people say, I don't want to know, I know everything. When people are caught up in the ego, the greed, the separation, that's what the matrix is. I told you this whole system was created to keep you divided, but you don't blame the game. You change the game. Mm. Slow motion this side mm. and you become player one. And that's how you break free from the matrix. So for example, a lot of people say, I'm this nationality, I'm this religion, I am Democrat, I am Republican, whatever. That's all the matrix. Because you see, the truth, when you break free from the Maya, you realize we are all connected. It's one humanity. Humanity has been divided because so long as you are divided, you can never see the truth. Separation is the greatest illusion ever. Unity is the greatest truth. Everybody bleeds red. So I'm not better than you. 
I am another you in a different time and space. So when we say namaste, that means the divine in me honors the divine in you. When I say in Lakesh, it means I am another version of you. We are one in the same. We are all stardust swirling around the Milky Way galaxy. Isn't that beautiful, deep divers? What is the matrix? How to break free? Welcome to the real world. This is the real world, right? There's no place I'd rather be than with the birds, bees, leaves, and trees. Do you know that the birds singing actually helps you to align your chakras? It's at a beautiful frequency. Go and walk into the concrete jungle. Listen to the sounds of the cars. The buildings, it doesn't bring a Zen feeling inside of you, but nature does. And this is the real world. Nature heals you. When you are in the heart of nature, start doing a little samba, baby. Raising the frequency. Take a look at the buildings. You see, thousands of years ago, they would create buildings to inspire people. Monuments that people were in awe of, like, oh my gosh, how did they build those pyramids? Like, wow, wow. But today, every building looks the same. And that's what the matrix says, it's straight lines. Do you know that in nature, you will never ever find a straight line because nature is curvy, woo, nature is wavy. Oh yeah, deep divers, there's no straight lines in nature. Everything is curves. And that's the real world. The matrix is straight lines, rigid rules, dogma, authoritarian dictators, subjugation. Anything that takes you away from who you really are is the matrix. Anytime you wear a mask, and a lot of people wear a mask every single day, now they've actually identified themselves with the mask. They can't even take it off because they they think that's who they are. You got a lot of people on these apps, TikTok. Are you not entertained? They're playing a character, it's not who they are. And that's what the matrix is. So you break free from the matrix when you remind yourself your authenticity is your greatest power. Nobody is you and that's your power. Have a mind of your own. You are born into a world where they wanna control how you think, what you eat, how you dress. They're like, Ralph, don't put on the turquoise. I'm like, excuse me? Welcome to the real world. I'm having a party out here. Pass me more turquoise. <laughs> it's freedom. This is how to break free from the matrix. You wanna be free. You wanna remind yourself that being free is your birthright. You wanna remind yourself you didn't come here to be a slave. The matrix is the plantation. So how do you break free from that? You gotta know your worth. You gotta remind yourself just because Simon says do this, you don't have to do that. You gotta learn how to think for yourself. Most of all, most of all, you have to develop critical thinking. What is the matrix? But a crowd going in the wrong direction. So if you follow the crowd, it's gonna end badly. The crowd is the matrix. When you are around a lot of people who don't think for themselves, Energy is contagious, you get sucked into a sunken place. This is the reason why when you see great spiritual masters, Jesus Christ, Buddha, Krishna, they're always by themselves, finding out who they really are, meditating, which is the art of absorbing yourself in the present moment, tapping in, tuning in. They realized the only way out is in. And this is how to break free from the matrix. The matrix is the circus show out there. Like Shakespeare said, the whole world is a stage designed to keep you distracted from who you really are. That's what the matrix is and you break free from it when you say, I don't wanna entertain this buffoonery. Ain't nobody got time for that. I don't wanna be programmed by the mainstream media. I wanna be free. The matrix is fear. False evidence appearing real. Fear is a hundred hertz. It's one of the lowest frequencies ever. This is the reason why as soon as you wake up, there's bad news. They keep you in those lower emotions, those lower emotions, fear, shame, guilt, grief. When you wake up, take a look at the news, 
you got bad news waiting for you. And that's what the matrix is. You break free from the matrix. You know, when I wake up, what I see? The birds, bees, leaves and trees. I'm out of the matrix. Welcome to the real world. It's beautiful out here. The matrix is your bedroom. The matrix is Apple Vision Pro, the metaverse. Don't you realize that there are no human beings left in supermarkets? Everything is self-service. That's what the matrix is. It's the machine world. Charlie Chaplin was telling you something. Go and listen to the world's greatest speech. He said, you've got to stop being machine men and machine women and go back to being real human beings. This is how to break free from the matrix. Deep divers. I'm not in the metaverse because I'm in the real world and it's beautiful. We're out of the matrix. <laughs> the matrix is war, huh? What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. You get out of the matrix when you are in a state of peace. That's a 600 Hertz frequency. You get out of the matrix when you are in a state of love. That's the 500 Hertz frequency. You're listening to that 528 Hertz. You're out of the matrix. You're listening to that 432 Hertz. You're getting out of the matrix. You're saying, actually, I don't want a slave job. I want to work on something that can help humanity. You're moving out of the matrix. You're focusing on saying, actually, it's not just about her backside or his muscles. I want to know their soul. Oh my gosh, deep divers, you're getting out of the matrix. I don't just want a physical connection. I want a heart connection, a mental connection, a spiritual connection. You feel me? Deep divers, they tried to bury us. They forgot we were seeds. Wake up, Neo. Wake up out of the deep sleep, out of the sunken place. And become who you really came here to be, which is a spiritual being having a human experience. Realize you are multidimensional. Realize you are infinite. I'm infinite waters, deep divers. One love, peace. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace.